Hello, I'm Lucas Gonzalez. IU is asking the Hillel Center to postpone an event featuring a Palestinian supporter of Israel. The university cites unspecified security concerns over the event, which was scheduled for Tuesday at Wilkinson Hall. Mossab Hassan Youssef was set to headline the event. He says regional FBI offices identified serious and credible security concerns. However, both the FBI and the center itself declined to comment. Indiana Grad Workers Union is proposing a three-day strike next month. If authorized, the strike would fall on IU Day, when the campus is packed with visitors. The group voted no confidence in IU President Pamela Witten last month after they did not get the higher pay and union recognition they had requested. The union last went on strike in 2022. And the Heidelberg Materials Plant in Mitchell will be awarded up to $500 million to treat and prepare 2 million tons of CO2 it produces each year. It's going to become uh, the most sustainable operation in the history of the world in terms of building cement, which is the foundation for so many uh, projects. The plant is one of the biggest recipients of funding from a U.S. Department of Energy project to reduce industrial greenhouse gas emissions. Weather tonight, thunderstorms and a low of 24 degrees. And for the five-day forecast, thunderstorms continue tomorrow with a high of 65. Mostly sunny weather from Wednesday until Friday and then partly sunny again on Saturday. For more local news, go to WTIUNews.org and catch Indiana News Desk Fridays at 6 p.m.